in loading x-rays from a CD that was burned from a hospital radiology center or another source, um, you don't need to use the native software that came with the CD to pull those images into Posture. As you can see, I have my own study that was done at a, uh, a, a clinic when I had my x-rays taken. I don't need to use this one, so what we can do is we can go ahead and quit the native viewer that came with it. What we're going to do is I'm going to add that, that patient to Posture. So let me go ahead and log in to Posture, and I'm using the generic login. And we're going to make sure that that patient is created in the account. So I'm just starting from scratch. We can go ahead and see that I have a Joe Ferrantelli. So we're going to do a new valuation on Joe Ferrantelli. This x-ray was taken on uh, in 2012. It's very important that you get the dates correct when dealing with digital x-ray. So this was on 818. And we'll say it was a re-exam. Okay. Now we're going to pull in, we're going to do a lateral cervical, and I'm going to browse just like normal. This time I'm going to choose the CD DVD drive, and I'm going to browse to that location. So you can see we have the x-rays right here. And many times there's a folder called images or DICOM, okay? Sometimes we can just click the top folder, okay? Uh, this time I'm just going to click the images folder and just hit OK and let's hit search and if it can't find those names let's go ahead and try I believe it may have been under Joseph there we go so you can see I did Joe it found those images we select all that's how case sensitive it is I had my name in posture as Joe but when they burned the x-rays they burned it as Joseph so you saw what I did I just deleted a letter so that way it would only search for J-O so those are all selected. I hit OK, and then now it's going to access the CD. It's going to be a little slower, and this version of Posture may look a little different than the one that you're currently using because this is the latest release. Okay, so we'll just pull in a couple of x-rays right here. We're going to do a flexion, and we're going to pull in another one here. Let's see what the next x-ray is. It's spinning up my drive as we speak. Here we go. And there's my lateral cervical, so we're going to map that one. And I'm just going to go ahead and pull these in. So we're going to pull this lateral cervical in. We'll say yes, we want to accept it. And if we wanted to pull in the, the other flexion one, we'll go ahead and say yes. And we'll do the extension, and we'll say yes as well too. Um, and remember, with digital x-ray, of course, we can come over here and make the image brighter. And let's go ahead and change the contrast a little bit as well too. So that's as quick and easy as it is to pull in an x-ray from a DICOM CD. It's quite that simple. If you have any more questions, please feel free to reach out to us at info at postureco.com. That's info at postureco.com. Thank you.